In this video, I will discuss gene mutations, specifically point mutations. A gene mutation is defined as a permanent alteration in the DNA sequence that makes up a gene. A point mutation is when a single base pair is altered, meaning a base was exchanged for another. The bases of a gene are divided into two groups, purines and pyrimidines. Purines are adenine and guanine, while pyrimidines are thymine, cytosine, and uracil. Uracil replaces thymine in the RNA. Purines and pyrimidines can experience two kinds of mutations, transition and transversion. A transition mutation is the replacement of a purine for a purine or pyrimidine for pyrimidine. A transversion mutation is the replacement of a purine for pyrimidine or pyrimidine for purine. Before I cover the different point mutations, the original mRNA sequence must be altered. The thymine bases will become uracil bases, and now we have the RNA strand and its corresponding amino acids. The four point mutations I will cover are missense, nonsense, silent, and read-through. A missense mutation is the substitution of a single nucleotide base for another. This substitution results in a codon that inserts a different amino acid into the sequence, changing the protein. This can cause changes in the effectiveness of a protein, making it more or less productive, or can make the protein non-functional. It can also have no effect on the protein structure. In this mutation, you can see that a cytosine was substituted for guanine. This is a transversion mutation because a pyrimidine was swapped for a purine. The amino acid cysteine now becomes tryptophan when translated. A nonsense mutation is the change of a base that results in a stop codon. This early stopping of translation results in a protein that is abbreviated and incomplete, often making it non-functional. In this mutation, you see that a guanine was substituted for an adenine. This is a transition mutation because a purine was substituted for a purine. The amino acid tryptophan now translates to a stop codon, making the protein non-functional. A silent mutation is when a base nucleotide is substituted, but there are no changes. This substitution happens when multiple codons can translate into the same amino acid. Since the protein is not affected, this mutation goes by unnoticed. In this mutation, you see that a cytosine is substituted for a uracil. This is a transition mutation because a pyrimidine was exchanged for a pyrimidine. The amino acid asparagine remains the same because there are two codons that translate for the amino acid. This allows the protein to maintain its original function. The last mutation is called a read-through. This mutation changes the stop codon into a codon that has an amino acid, allowing the sequence to continue, resulting in a longer protein. This could affect the function of the protein. In this mutation, you see a guanine substituted for a uracil. This is a transversion mutation because a purine was exchanged for a pyrimidine. The stop codon now becomes leucine and continues the sequence. Hopefully now you have a better understanding on the different kinds of point mutations. It is important to understand how these mutations function because they can have both positive and negative effects on our health.